I'm here to endorse Rick Noriega, a longtime personal friend who is a member of the Texas State Legislature, uh, someone who has distinguished himself with his work uh, not only in the National Guard, uh, where he has uh, served overseas and served valiantly, I might add, as a tremendous leader, but also came back uh, and was deployed to the border of the United States between the United States and Mexico, where again uh, he served uh, with brilliance uh, in, in making a difference for our country. Later, he was assigned to be one of the few people uh, to lead major efforts in uh, overseeing the movement of tens of thousands of people uh, from New Orleans during the Katrina catastrophe. Uh, that was a significant thing that happened to the city of Houston. Uh, Rick made unbelievable friends, but also made unbelievable progress for families that were hurting, people who needed help and attention. He was there in the midst of his fight and did a tremendous job for Texas and for the United States of America. It's with a lot of pride that I'll give him my endorsement. Uh, we are seeing the state of Texas moderate significantly over what it was. Uh, we are seeing an opportunity, in my opinion, uh, not just for people like me to win congressional seats, but for someone like Rick Noriega, who has distinguished himself so much uh, with his military service, with his public service, uh, to be able to have an opportunity to reach a wide variety of people and to get and to win their support in, in doing so. Uh, Rick is the kind of political worker, uh, campaigner, uh, who will be able to do uh, more than a, the normal candidate, and I like to say, because he knows how to go to the grassroots. His family spreads out across Texas. Uh, much of his family lives in the congressional district that I represent, District 22, uh, and I think that they are a tremendous asset to him. The fact that Melissa, um, Rick's wife, serves on the Houston City Council further shows their commitment to trying to make our communities better places in which to live. That's the commitment that Rick has brought to his public life, and I think that he will have a good opportunity to become the senator uh, from the state of Texas. The biggest reason that I ran for Congress was, was the polarization of this country, the polarization of our politics. Uh, we are so divided that we can't resolve hard issues that face this country, and if we don't, we're going to leave even a, an even greater mess for our children. And there are so many issues that we can talk about, whether it has to do with the uh, Children's Health Insurance Program, which is a critical, uh, critical program, whether it's education, whether it's science, whether it's defense of our nation. Uh, as we split ourselves politically, we don't have the ability to pull ourselves back together. I think that Rick Noriega has proven that he has the ability to be a uniter. He has the ability to make sure that, uh, that, that we reach out on a bipartisan manner to compromise, to work with the other side, not be one that is going to be there solely uh, for, his, uh, for his party. I think he's going to put the people of the United States of America before that, uh, that party effort. That's what I've been trying to do in Congress. Uh, we're achieving that, but it's gonna take action on the part of the people of this country to continue the process. It's my hope that we'll recognize that it is time for us to put the American people first. This is an opportunity to do it, and that's why I'm gonna be voting for Rick Noriega.